So the monkfish gets glazed and then we'll carve it. And then that'll go on the plate after the monkfish has gone on. So we'll just put a little bit of Tokyo cross turnip that has been pickled in sort of like a little house pickle that we use, which is a good Chardonnay vinegar, a touch of sugar and some water. So just a nice light pickle, such acidity to that meatiness of the dish. Sea veg, sort of like sea veg, the sea aster, sea beets. We've got a little bit of monk's beard on there as well. We want to keep this nice, fresh and crunchy to go against the meatiness of the, of the fish. So this just gets basically dipped five to 10 seconds in a little bit of sort of like a seaweed stock that we use. That goes on the plate. We've got some cresses, so some nasturtium, some winter purslane and some sea purslane. A little bit of Chardonnay vinegar, which has been mixed with sort of like a dash of vinegar is the best way of saying it. Then it all gets finished with the uh, Solway brown shrimp sauce, uh, which has just been slightly aerated. It just gives a bit more lightness to the dish. So here we have a beautiful roasted monkfish dish with a sauce made from Solway brown shrimps.